The word Hindu, what's the origin and what's going on there? You see, in ancient times in northwest part of India flowed a river, very huge river called the river Sindhu. Sindhu in Sanskrit means a river or a huge amount of mass of water. So they were calling the river the river. We are very clear cut about things like that. <laughs> so the river is called the river Sindhu. So far so good. And then the story goes that we had visitors, you know, because India was a very popular destination in ancient times, but still it is now. Every time, winter time, all the people disappear there. So we had the ancient Persians coming to India, and they had a quirk in their language. You know, we all have quirks. They had a habit of replacing the sir sound with the her sound. So when they came and we said Sindhu, they said, oh, Hindu, Hindu. And we are kind of very compliant, easygoing, relaxed people. So we say, okay, call it Hindu. <laughs> we should have stuck to our guns and no, it's Hindu. <laughs> we let go. So it became Hindu. In fact, I suspect, I mean, I don't know, because I've not thought about it. If any of you are coming from Gujarat or Saurashtra, in that part of the world, we still have a habit of replacing the sir sound with the her pronunciation. They don't say, Sus, I'm blue. They say, who, I'm blue. <laughs> And the wife will tell the husband, Sakhanario, but they won't say Sakhana, they say, Hakhanario. <laughs> because there are a lot of Gujarati, so I can carry away, I can get away with this Gujarati humor. So we still do this sir into her all the time. So you see, the, the river Sindhu became Hindu, and the people living across the river were called Hindus. That's how we acquired the name. And the story didn't stop there. Then we had the Greeks turning up, because I told you, we were a popular destination. So the Greeks turned up, and they had a problem with the her sound. They like to pronounce it, oh. They like, oh. So they looked at this and it's going in the, the, the river Hindu was flowing quite sweetly. They say, oh, it's the Hindu. No, Hindu, Indus. <laughs> so it turned into Indus. It's still called river Indus. And it's the people who live across the river Indus we'll call the people of Indoi. And from there, we derive the word India. So the whole thing started, the whole saga started because people could not pronounce the name of a river correctly. So you got a name of a religion, name of a country, everything started with the river Sindhu. It's nice for you to know the background, the like historic background of the word Hindu as well. Free e-learning course in Hinduism. To register, please visit www.hindu-academy.com. Talks on Hinduism. Sponsored by People Care. Encouraging caring for the elderly in their own homes. For more information, please visit peoplecare.com.